What up family, it's your boy V. Welcome back to another V Vlogs video. Galveston Fishing Pier Part 2, Beginner's Luck. And if you haven't checked out part number one, I will leave the link in the description so you can go check it out. Now let's start with the title. It's called Beginner's Luck because I don't know anything about big game saltwater fishing. As a matter of fact, before we even got to the pier, I was texting my buddy on what I needed to get, what I needed to use, what leader, what line, what type of fishing pole, because I knew nothing about this and I wanted to get it right. I probably spent about an hour in academy trying to decide what pole I wanted. I mean, do I want to flex on everybody? <laughs> You're goddamn right. But Realistically, I'm balling on a budget. As some of you guys might know, it is tough out here for a fishing YouTube vlogger. And after searching and searching in the fishing pole dealership, I finally decided to get the Pen Pursuit 3 8000 series. For my fishing line, I went with the Power Pro 80 pound test line, braided yellow high visibility, all 300 yards that it came with it because it was $42 and I was like, you're yeah, damn right, I'm gonna put it off. The fishing pole itself was only $90. It was the combo, so you get the reel and the pole for $90. So I thought that was actually a very, very good deal. And after testing it, it was so good that I decided to buy a second one. So now I got twins. I don't know if you guys noticed the bridge net with the yellow rope on it, but I also bought that from Academy. I bought it for $25 and I honestly wasn't even going to buy it the day of. But if you've seen part one, you'll see that it was actually really highly needed to land my biggest fish. And um, yeah, that was a good choice. For bait, we were using shad and mullet and crab as well, but all we were really doing was just feeding all the smaller fish and the big fish were not interested at all. Until we switched to whiting. Then the shark and the stingray started to bite. So the man on the screen right now fighting the shark with my fishing pole was actually helping me and Laura out because I went to the bathroom and it's crazy because I thought to myself, yo, I bet you something's gonna run off with my bait and I'm not gonna be there. And Laura's gonna be all alone to fight it herself. And sure enough, as I was walking back from the distance, I could see Laura with a fishing pole trying to hook up this shark and she successfully did it and it started pulling drag like crazy. I wasn't there to film it, I'm bummed, but we did get the we did get the fish and we both got an experience out of it so it was actually a team effort laura hooked on the fish um, the guy fought the fish and i landed the fish now this guy and his son legit helped us out so much because we didn't know anything i couldn't even cast far and they taught me how to cast how to hook up uh, my bait how to put the, the hook with the spider weight before launching it and uh, just told us basically while we were fighting the fish what the fish were going to do. They were going to swim towards the beach, then swim towards the deep, then swim towards the pier and once they seen the pier it was going to take off again and then they was going to try to go under the pier and it was just spot on. Like these guys knew exactly what they were doing and it just it's so amazing that you know they wanted to help and they were if you've seen the videos of me fighting the fish they were alongside of me the whole time guiding me just helping us out so much i don't know about you guys but for it being our very first time really doing some big game saltwater fishing i think it went phenomenal it was successful it was epic it is a night that i will never ever forget the strength and the power that these fish have is just so mind-blowing and i honestly cannot wait to go and do it again um and see see what's out there see what i can get see if i can break some more pbs and uh yeah it was it was truly amazing and thank you guys all for watching till next time it's your boy v i'm out
Yeah, we weren't expecting that, but the shark did swim away and everybody was safe. That's how it was done. That's how you throw it in there. Wow.